Hello, good people. This is Sherry Shine with Sharika Originals. We're going to make some nameplate earrings today. Okay, I am going to make some name earrings for a, a client of mine. So I go to Silhouette Business Edition and I click on the A, which is going to give me the ability to write as soon as I get Okay, the word that I'm working with is Nubian. It's N-U-B-I-A-N. Gotta check that to make sure. And, and then the second part is she also wants Mother of the Revolution. Let's see. Mother. Let's see. Of the. And then I'm going to say. Revolution. Okay, here we go. Mother of the Revolution. Not that. I want this to, to be centered on each other, so I'm going to go up to, I don't know what we call this, but I'm going to go up here to, to where you, I'm going to choose the one that centers everything, so choose that one. So now that's centered. So now I'm going to go back to my word Nubian, and I'm going to select the font that I want. I'm going to go up here and I tend to like Dancer. Let me see if I can find Dancer. The Dancer font. Either Dancer or um, there's another one that I like. Okay, Milkshake. Let's try Milkshake. Oh, come now. Here's my husband. He's always okay. Nubian. All right. I like the way that looks. Okay. So I have my word here, and now the next thing um, I need to um, weld it. So because if you can see, each letter is uh, individual, but I need to weld it so that they will all be together. So I'm gonna go up to I'm going to select my weld and I'm going to weld it all together then after I get welded then I'm going to go to my offset panel and I'm going to offset it once it's offset then um, we're going to be ready to cut it Before I cut it, I need to click on my offset and change the color so that uh, I'll have two different colors. One color will tell uh, the system to uh, engrave and the other will tell it to cut. So that's what I'm doing here. I prefer that my engrave uh, color be red, so I'm going to change the engrave color. I'm going to change the name to red, and then uh, once I have my offset, I'm going to change the offset to black. So I'll have red and black. Red will be engraved, black will be cut.
So now that's done. So it's time to save it and then go to the Glowforge. I'm using mirror acrylic and I like to paint the back of my mirror acrylic. You know, it comes gray and I take um, this um, silver color paint and just spray paint the back of it. It just makes it look a lot nicer to me. Okay, I got it all cut out. And now all I need to do is glue it to the, pre, uh, the purchased earrings that I have. I'm using E6000, although I really uh, prefer uh, Gorilla Glue, but I couldn't find my Gorilla Glue for anything. When you're gluing your name on, make sure that you uh, be careful to see what side the name is gonna show. Um, to, to make sure that you put it put your name on the right side of the earring.